Welcome to the Westport Library's Deep Dive into Databases. This tutorial will introduce you to Hoopla using your computer. Hoopla is an e-library borrowing service available for use with your Westport Library card. It offers thousands of titles in a range of formats including text, audiobooks, and film. It can be accessed by visiting hooplaDigital.com or through the Digital Library page on the Westport Library website. To begin, you will first have to create an account and link it with your library card. Click the Get Started button. And then click Let's Go to begin registration. You will be asked to select your library. If it does not appear on the provided list, type Westport Library into the search bar and it should come up in the search results. Click on it. Once your library is selected, you will be prompted for your library card number and PIN. The default PIN is the last four digits of your phone number. Next, enter your email address and create a password. Finally, click Complete Registration. Once you're registered, anytime you return to Hoopla, you will be brought back to the My Hoopla page. This is a home page with quick links for you. It contains info on titles you are currently borrowing, the number of remaining titles you can borrow this month, as well as recommendations for other books. At the top of the page are different options for finding titles. You can click Browse to peruse different formats or use the search bar to find a specific title. Under the Browse menu, you will also find a link to Binge Pass. These are collections of books and videos that can be checked out using only one of your monthly borrows. You can also filter your search. For example, this search could be narrowed in multiple ways, including by format, rating, and release date. There is also a kids mode. This will limit the available material to content oriented at kids 12 and under. Clicking on a title will provide you with additional information like a summary and reviews. It will also tell you the lending policy. If a title sounds interesting, click Borrow. It will ask you to confirm the borrow. After that, your Borrow icon will now say Read. Once you begin reading, an interactive window will open up. There are many options here to optimize your reading experience. You can skip through pages using the slider bar or by clicking the far ends of the screen. You can use the icon at the top right to bookmark a page. The three line icon at the top left will open an option menu. This will allow you to do a number of things like search the book, Jump to a specific chapter or adjust settings like text size and line spacing. When you're done reading, click Close Reader. The book will now be on your My Hoopla homepage ready to resume whenever you are ready. Now you should have the skills necessary to get started with Hoopla. If you need additional assistance, help is available at the Westport Library or by emailing our reference department at ref at westportlibrary.org.